Jaden from Tech for Days, and today we're going to be reviewing the Silicon Power B05. This is the Blaze series. It's a USB 3.0 and it's a little thumb drive. It's a really, really nice drive. If you guys haven't watched the unboxing, I suggest you guys go check that out. It has been a while since I've done the unboxing, so I did want to give you guys a good review. Now, these oh, Silicon Power is literally amazing. I love them. They have lifetime warranty on their thumb drives. They have three year warranty on their hard drives. They just want to pass out warranty like candy because they're just so confident that their drives are really good. And I'm very confident in that. I love their drives. I love everything that they make. It's really, really awesome. And this flash drive is awesome. It's a 32 gig. It comes all the way in 128 gig. And I think it only runs like 50 bucks. That's like an amazing price for 128 gigabytes of storage. That's just amazing. I just love that. So now I do, I will be able to do a disk speed test with this, I believe. So I am going to try to do that so you guys can see the transfer speeds. But the transfer speeds are USB 3.0, so they are very fast. I just, I'm so excited about this drive. If you guys haven't watched my other review, I did do a review of the Blaze B30, which is a metal um, swivel drive that they actually have and it's really really nice flash drive that one comes in 128 gigs too I suggest you guys look that up on Amazon or Newegg because that's where they sell it's a really cool drive it's called the Blaze B30 it's really really nice here is the Blaze B30 this is also a USB 3.0 32 gig flash drive with swivel capabilities it's really really nice these are both Blaze series except this one is swivel and it has some aluminum and this one is all plastic they're both USB 3.0. As you can see, they both have the little blue accent right there. So we'll set that aside. And now we're going to just get to my overall thoughts on this flash drive. I really like the transfer speeds. It's really, really nice transfer speeds. I love the storage capacities. The feel of the drive is pretty nice. It is plastic, unlike the Blaze B30. It has a mixture of aluminum and plastic. But this one's actually very, very nice in the hands. It's similar to a SanDisk type drive and you just simply place your thumb and slide it down it's really really nice and you do have a little key ring hole and this pops up in my Mac extremely fast as soon as I plug it in it's already ready to use for me and it's just really awesome so I want to try to do this disk speed test so let's go ahead and jump into that so I do want to show you guys that this is where I'm plugging it in into my USB 3.0 hub and here I do have some silicon power hard drives that you guys can check out. This is the A15 and this is the A30. The A30 is on a time machine backup and this one's just for extra files. So I do have those connected. And if you guys can't see, this drive actually has a nice little red LED indicator to let you know that it's active. So I think that's really, really awesome that it actually has an active indicator. And I rem if you guys haven't watched my Blaze B30 review or you haven't looked uh, looked on Amazon for any of those reviews. I actually mentioned that I wish it had a nice little light, but this one, the Blaze B05, actually has a light with it, so that's really nice to see that they do actually have different options with different lights and stuff like that. It's nice to see that all their flash drives aren't just the same stuff. It's different. Everything's different. For example, the A15 is completely different from the A30. They look totally different and have different features. And Silicon Power puts effort into their products. They don't just throw out all crap kind of materials. They actually redesign them and make them better, add more features. This one has an auto backup button. So it's just really cool. So without further ado, let's continue with the flash drive. So guys, as you can see on the right, I do have the flash drive right here. And I'm actually going to eject it to show you guys how quickly it actually ejects. Boom, it's gone already. And then I'm going to plug it back in to my USB 3.0 hub, and you'll see how quick it is to respond. Boom! We're back and ready to use. You can simply open it up, view the contents, and all the warranty. You have a little warranty thing, but I can't open it because this is actually a Microsoft file, so I won't be able to actually open it, as you can see. So I do think they should add a Mac file so you can actually read the warranty guy. The only way I'll be able to read this is to plug this into my Windows or... Window or Microsoft enabled device, so be careful with that. And I do, I will be able to do a disk speed test, so let's go ahead and do that. 
since this is a solid state drive or a flash drive, so we will be able to do that. So right here I'll click settings, select target drive, and we have the flash drive right here. We'll click choose, and we are going to start the test. Boom, we're getting around 40 to 45 megabytes for a write speed. Very, very nice for a flash drive. It could be just a little bit better, but we won't be um, transferring anything that large anyways. As you can see, it's struggling just a little bit more as it performs a different test. So that's very awesome. And here we have a read drive of 147 megabytes, and it's pretty constant. Around every test, it's reading the same 150, 152, 147. So that's really awesome that it actually has a really nice read speed. I do think that the write speed could be just a little bit better, but for a flash drive that's 32 gigs, you won't be transferring anything that large in the first place, mainly documents, which will transfer instantly with 37 megabytes. Because if you have a document that's 37 megabytes, God bless you, because I don't know what kind of papers you're writing, because that's just crazy. So we do have pretty much a constant read speed. As you guys can see, it's, it's not really changing too much. The write speed does fluctuate from 29 to 40 to 45. So that just depends on the different kind of test that we're actually performing. And I'm actually really impressed with this drive. The little red LED indicator is actually flashing, obviously, because we are reading and writing. So I think it's just a really, really nice flash drive. It's very, very cheap. The drive comes in 128 gigs, 64, 32, 16, 8, all kinds of freaking capacities. And it's just awesome. Even their hard drives are 500, 1 terabyte, 2 terabyte. You just have a lot of options with flash storage and hard storage. So I just think it's a really awesome drive. We have great transfer speeds. And I just love it. It's perfect for school. I can clip it on my keychain, and the USB portion is actually protected since it goes inside of the flash drive. And it's just a really, really nice drive. I really do recommend it. And if you guys have any questions or anything like that, go ahead and leave them below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you haven't seen the unboxing, you can try to check that out on my YouTube channel. It was a very, very cool unboxing because I unboxed a bunch of products at once. It's really fun. So be sure to rate this as helpful or like this video. If you have any questions or concerns or anything like that, be sure to leave that below. And I did forget to mention that the stress level is 5 gigs for this flash drive. So that's just crazy. We have really good results. I'm very impressed with this flash drive. So be sure to check out the different priorities and just check out their check out Silicon Power store. They have just a bunch of stuff. Just check it out. They're really cheap. If if I had a shopping spree, I'd definitely probably buy everything in their store. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Have a great day. <laughs>